everybody, I'm Adam Williston and this is your package point of view. Today's point of view is that of Goodbye Beatdown. This BC band has a total lockdown on a mix of genres that has your mind thinking you're relaxed, all where you're ripping it up on the dance floor. It's truly insane that a band can have this kind of manic energy, but yet you still think you're totally good. So what's in this fusion of style and manic energy? Let's go find out. Lord. Yeah. Sitting here with Dizzy Dustin Overhill, I had the pleasure of hooking up with him and Goodbye Beatdown at last year's Juno festivities, and we got along like gin and tonic. So, Dustin, for those of our viewers who do not know you and your band, why don't you tell us uh, who you are and who else is in the band? Uh, we are Goodbye Beatdown from Langley, British Columbia. There is uh, me, I'm the lead singer slash rapper. What do you what do you think? What would you call me? Vocals. I'm a vocalist. We've got Mark, who is the bass player. Peaches, who is our guitar player. We've got James, who's our DJ, and Branimer, who is our drummer from Bulgaria. I just like to add that. He's European. Last year at the same Junos where I met you uh, was actually when the band made the transition from Critical Element to Goodbye B-Town. Can you uh, tell us a little bit about that name change and uh, you know what that all was all about? Well, Critical Element was like a hemorrhoid, and Goodbye B-Town is like Preparation H. <laughs> there you go. Actually, Adam... I met a young man named George Strombolopoulos while I was at the uh, Artist Sanctuary for the Junos, and I threw a bunch of names past him, and he's like, I think that's the best name, Goodbye Beatdown, that you have out of all the bunch of names that you had. So we just stuck with that, and it was a good story to tell. And yeah, it's been like that ever since. So it's George's baby. It's George's, it's George's baby, a illegitimate child. Last year, uh, C Fox Vancouver Seeds competition, Goodbye Beatdown was the platinum finalist. Give me a little background information on what that contest is all about and sort of what the experience was like. Every year there's about 300, 400 bands from Vancouver that co go into the event and they choose and they seat it, seat it down to 20 and then seat it down to 10 and then 5 and this year it was 3. So we were the Platinum Award winners. Other bands that won it were like Nickelback, Default, Matthew Good, Biff Naked, a bunch of those bands. So it was really good and prestigious to win it. And yeah, it's been really good to us. We're happy that we could uh, accomplish something like that. So other than the prestige, what do you get in the prize pack for that? Is it the sort of supporting uh, effort for you guys? Um, you get to work with really influential people in the industry, like Ralph James, the agency, and just people that you hear about but have never, you couldn't really contact just by calling them. You know? And you're off to Ontario for a little tour here? Yep, leaving six days, going across to Montreal. First time in Montreal. Been to Ontario a couple times. Never been to Montreal. Montreal Look out, out, Montreal. You guys are heading into the studio after the tour, is that right? Yes, we're going to be in there for a couple months, actually, doing pre-production and then uh, working on a new album, our debut album, actually. Tell me a little bit about who you're working with and uh, what you got up your sleeves. I know that we're going to be doing some production with Classified, so I might be heading out to Nova Scotia, hang out with Class, and uh, props to Class. And... Uh, it's getting produced by a man from a band called the Paolas. I don't know if you know you. That's a little your era, hey? <laughs> no offense, really. Yeah. But uh, yes, yeah, this man, Richard Serra from the Paolas, he uh, is going to be producing the album. He's a really good producer, a good guy. I'm really stoked. So for uh, PKG viewers who uh, don't know where to go find you and your music, where's a good place for them to check out? Goodbyebeatdown.com or facebook.com slash goodbyebeatdown. Check us out. And uh, if you need anything, just message us and I'll personally deliver it to you. You're on set today shooting a video for what? which single? What you gonna do, Lord? Yeah. And when are we uh, going to uh, sort of see this, the result of said shoot? Hopefully in a month or so. There was a lot of pretty girls out. And uh, they're, wait, they're still there. Uh, yeah, no, they had to go. But there was a, a lot of pretty girls. And if you want to check out the video, go to YouTube and, or go to our MySpace. Or go to our website, goodbyebeatdown.com. That's it for this package point of view. I want to thank uh, Dizzy here and all the Goodbye Beatdown crew. Until next time, wrap it up in style. And don't forget to get down with the beatdown. Thanks so much. Again, check us out, goodbyebeatdown.com. Adam, you're a homie. Much love. PKG represent. I'll let your boy. Peace. You